All right, you were warned. <laughs> this shit is crazy. But listen, we live in a world where you have to be protecting yourself. Welcome back to my channel, you guys. So today, my friend and I are going to Primark and I don't know if I want to take my camera. I don't know. The battery that's in there right now, I just put it in last night. You know, I should've, hold on. So I thought, so this camera, I literally have to format it before I start recording because if I don't do that, it just corrupts the footage. So I've done that. Today is one of those cooler days. I'm wearing the sweater that I got from H&M a long time ago. Absolutely love it. I got three. A gray one, this color, and a black one. Can't remember. But this, like, is one of my favorite tones on me. Last night, we agreed that we would leave uh, is at 10 o'clock. Right now, it's 10 to 30. Okay. But she said that she had to cook and stuff, and I had a lot going on too, so ended up working out. And so, she just texted me that she is gonna go shower. And I guess start getting ready. So when she texts me and tells me that she's done showering, I'm gonna leave because the way how these buses are running, and I wanted to pop by a store on the avenue to buy some masks. It's 61 degrees outside, so I'm not gonna change it. I'm gonna run downstairs really quickly and check the mail and also test out the weather outside. I'm so tempted to wear my Crocs today, but I just feel like, all right, Janine, you're OD in the Crocs. Leave the Crocs alone. Even though it's not supposed to rain today, the Crocs are just so comfortable. I think I'm gonna end up wearing a slip-on. This one here. Especially cause my, especially cause my bag is tan or whatever. So I think I'll wear that one. I need to make sure that I have everything that I need inside of this pocketbook too. I have my mask, I watched this last night. That's the good thing about these masks. You can wash it today and it's ready tomorrow. So you could always have clean masks. So I have my mask, I have my purse, I have my um, keys, hand sanitizer. What else would I need? I have my camera battery in here and another memory card because I've decided that I'm gonna take my camera with me because my husband always says, Oh, why don't you ever take your camera? When are you gonna get over the fear of vlogging in public? So since I'm not gonna be by myself today, I think I might take the camera with me. Hopefully that goes well and I actually use it because I'd be so afraid to like whip it out, but we'll see. <clears throat> we will definitely see today. So I'll take it with me, but for the most part, I'm pretty much ready just waiting on a homegirl here to text me back. I definitely have to make sure that I pee before I go because we're going all the way to Brooklyn and so it's probably gonna take us like an hour. But we'll see. I made sure that I got up and like ate something. I have some coffee here that I made and it got cold and this has been an everyday thing for me and coffee lately. Friend over here. Look at the size of this fucking basket. Hi guys, I'm back home and look at this huge bag from Primark. I'm gonna quickly go through and show you guys some of the things that I got. And let me tell you something. I really feel like I need to go back because the prices of everything was just so good. Like, I really had to compose myself in there so I don't get carried away. So first, Bought a Philly cheesesteak that I'm gonna eat soon. Bought these masks that I spoke about for $6.99 for $15 a pack because we live in the era of masks. I bought these little house dresses that I feel like are so, so cute to just slip on just around the apartment because they're so easy. And let me tell you how this is a small and yet it's so very roomy. So we love. I bought this other cute one, I loved it the um, pattern on this one. This is also in a small, because their sizes run big. So because their sizes run big, you have to kind of size down. I bought some leggings because I absolutely love leggings and they were $3.50. 
I really should have bought more. I don't know why I just took two up, honestly. Bought them in a size medium and the material is really nice too. But I definitely think that I'm gonna go back and it's not too far from my house, so. Love that for me. So I bought two of the same leggings in a size medium in black. I've been buying leggings in H&M for $9.99. I bought this. I've wanted one of this little puffer jacket for a little while, but not the ones that are too thick. One that I can still wear a sweater with and it's still lightweight. Like I could wear a shirt under this sweater, this sweater and this, and I still have enough room. And I bought this in a size large so that I'd be able to have enough room to layer up underneath it. So, love that for me. And it has pockets on the outside here. Always wanted one of this for so long. I was gonna buy one on Shein that I'm pretty sure wasn't even the same type of quality. And this was $20. And I feel like that was a pretty good price. This one, you can fold it all the way down and put it into this little bag that comes on there, which I think it's very dope. They had these little shorts and uh, is this gonna sound good? Probably not. When I'm home, when I'm inside, I like to be <laughs> in the nude or half naked, okay? And this to me is being half naked on a small top. And um, these shorts, I paid $2 for. And before, the original price was $4 and I paid $2. So I bought a few. How many did I buy? I think three or two. There weren't many left because obviously with the prices, there's not gonna be a lot of them just laying around. And these are size small as well. And then I bought this cute little top. I had something similar to this, but more neon -y at one point. But I love this. There's a bicycle on it that says floor more. And then I bought this black shirt because at my other job, we mostly wear black and I thought this was dope and this was just $4. The price of this reminds me of the shirts that I'd normally buy inside of H&M. I found this cute little sweater and oh my gosh. I also got this in a US small and I paid $3 for this. If they had this in more colors, I honestly would have had more. I have something similar to this right now, but I've been really into pink lately. I have something super similar to this in terms of like the material is nice and soft, but I paid way more for it. I think $12 or so. So for $3, of course I would have taken it. And I bought these shoes for my daughter. These were $5. I got this one. She is worth size five right now. So I got this in size six. So I sized up with those so that I'll be able to send them next year and they're still able to fit her. I got her a black pair as well. So this black pair, this nude pair with black and I got her. This is more of like, kind of like slip-ons but like sandal stick that you put your foot in and like, I don't know how to explain it, but it's super cute. And all these shoes that I showed you guys were for $5 as well. So that's $15 for those three shoes. I bought a keychain. I need to stop buying little things like this because honestly I don't need them for $1.39. I didn't buy this in Primark. I bought this on the Avenue in the same store that I bought the mask in. And I bought this pepper spray, okay? Don't nobody try me or I will be lighting people up, okay? All right, you were warned. <laughs> this shit is crazy. But listen, we live in a world where you have to be protecting yourself. So I'm definitely gonna be putting this on my key as well with my new keychain. I think I have too many things on my key. And then when I was in the checkout line, I saw this other dress. This one, it was for four dollars. What I should have done was see if I saw this one in different colors and got three of this instead of the other one. But I really, really liked the other one. And at that point, the other one was in the bottom of my bag and I didn't even remember what was in the bag. Okay, but you know, it's this relaxed fitting type of, honestly, at this point in the year, I absolutely do not need any more clothes, okay? Earlier this year, I bought some stuff from Shein for the summer and then I'm buying this stuff now and obviously I have clothes already. But I feel like the only thing that I needed was a little jacket like that, which I currently obviously have right now. So I don't need anything else at this moment. All these things, I'm gonna put them in my laundry basket for when I go do my laundry on Friday. But that was it for spend the day with me shopping at Primark video. And I got this amazing bag for $2 and love that for me because obviously it's reusable and we also live in 
the time off reusable bags so definitely gonna need that and it's very oversized so you could fit so much in there my head hurts very bad and I gotta go warm up this coffee that I left here all morning and drink it and take two excedrin to see if I can make this headache despair okay yes and I'm also gonna try and minimize the size of my pocketbook right now because this shit is heavy after walking around with this heavy ass Primark bag today I just felt like we don't need no heavy bags like that needs to change so we're gonna do that but yeah that's it for this video thank you guys for watching i hope you guys enjoyed it i'll see you guys in the next video